Types of volcanoes. So we've seen how a volcano erupts, as well as where volcanoes can occur. So now we're going to look at the different kinds of volcano. And our first kind is called a shield volcano. And that name comes from the shape. A shield volcano is kind of shaped with the same sort of curvature as a shield. So it's very broad uh, at the base. The slopes are very gentle. If you want to climb a volcano, a uh, shield volcano is probably going to be the easiest one to make a trek up the side. They can be quite tall. So let's modify this by can be. This one isn't particularly tall. Uh, but within our solar system, uh, Olympus Mons on Mars is the tallest volcano. It is a shield volcano. And it is about three times the height of Mount Everest. So they have the potential to be quite tall. Depends on how many eruptions have occurred to add to the height. The lava produced by a shield volcano is viscous. So it's going to be slow moving typically. Uh, Hawaii is a shield volcano as well. And the lava that flows there typically is pretty slow. It kind of creeps down the sides. It's not a real fast motion. Our next type is called cinder cone. And here you can see the slope is very steep. Um, this would be difficult to walk up. I would not want to walk up a cinder cone volcano. They do tend to be pretty short. Uh, these uh, typically don't have a lot of eruptions, and so it doesn't have much opportunity to add to its height. Uh, also because of the steepness of the slope, it makes it harder to build up. The lava that comes from a cinder cone tends to be fairly runny, so it's fast moving. Now, as the name implies, there is cinder in the lava. Uh, but that fast motion is part of why it's so steep. So it doesn't have time to kind of build up on the sides. It just all runs down to the bottom. And so it doesn't have a chance to create the more gentle slopes that we saw with a shield volcano. Stratovolcanoes are kind of your stereotypical volcanoes. This is what you typically see in movies and things. And our slope is kind of intermediate. That's not as gentle as we saw with the uh, shield volcano, but certainly not as steep as the cinder cone. These can get very tall. Um, Mount Fuji is quite tall. And that is a stratovolcano. Uh, and as the name implies, strato, and that comes from stratosphere. Same root. Uh, so that reaches up pretty high into the atmosphere. The eruptions for stratovolcanoes, it's a variety of things. There's gas, there's lava, it's fairly explosive. So these are, you know, in all of these characteristics, very much what you think of when you think of your, you know, disaster movie volcano. Uh, typically, it's stratovolcano type characteristics that you will find. So these are the three main types of volcanoes that uh, occur here on Earth.